This video will show you how you can install APK files to your Oculus Quest 2 without the PC, without any wires, and without the phone. Now, why would you want to do this? Well, you can install mobile games like Fortnite or Call of Duty Mobile, or you can install emulators to run retro games. There are also free games available via itch.io, which require sideloading, so this is a handy shortcut. Just bear in mind you can install .apk files and not .xapk files using this method. Let's go! So first, what you need to do is install mobile vr station this is the app that everybody uses to install mods onto games like bone lab and blade and sorcery nomad now what you need to do is download an apk file this can be done by heading to the oculus browser and downloading one from the many sites that offer them for this i'll be using the side quest apk now once your apk is downloaded we need to go ahead and install it so first head over to mobile vr station click on the configuration wizard click show all options and click configure scoped storage and click step one request access and then a file system should pop up now just a note this isn't an official method implemented by the developer but it was something that just so happened to work now what you want to do is head back to standalone hmd click on the downloads folder and you should see your apk file here now click on the arrows in the top right and you should see a pop-up which looks like this now click continue and then install but wait, sometimes when you click the arrows, there will be no pop-up and the screen will just go dark. This means the install message is there, it's just invisible, so all you have to do is click around this area a couple of times for it to work. If you do press the invisible button, you'll hear the quest noise that indicates you have pressed the button successfully. Now all you have to do is leave it a little while and press the same area again in order to open the app straight away. Now if you aren't sure if you installed the app or not, you can always head over to the library, click the search... Click this drop down here and head to unknown sources and any apps you install this way will be in this section. All you have to do is click it and launch your chosen app. And that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Peace.